All right, this next exercise is a shin box hip extension. So you're gonna start in a seated position, feet in front of you. If you need your hands for assistance, fantastic. Um, I'm gonna use this and show you this first with your hands. So place your hands down, internally rotate your left knee, driving outside to one knee. Make sure that your knee is aligned with your foot so you're creating this box. Then you're going to drive forward and get up into that hip extension while both the knees are down, creating that box. Take a seat. If you need your hands again for the help with the rotation and rotate, fantastic. And then drive on up into that hip extension. Hands down, rotate. Hip extension after you've done that shin box on that 90 to 90 hip rotation. If you don't want to use the hands, fantastic. You'll just need a little bit more core strength to sit on up as you do the transition with your feet and knees. The more traveling you do on the mat lets us know that we're probably not articulating as properly as we can and not controlling the motion as smooth as possible. So take your time and make sure you're not rolling back and forth into too many different positions or areas while on the floor.